so hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing well so in this video i am going to show you how you can make the flag using the blender and how you can animate that flag like this so without any further delay now let's get started the tutorial and before starting the tutorial guys i just want to tell you if you want to do practice on this project so you can download this project file from the description i will put the link on the description you can download from there free and now let's start the tutorial so here you can see guys for making the flag i have uh, used the uh, plane here you can see and i have also used the the indian flag uh, texture okay and uh, for making the rod i use the cylinder and i put the material as a metal here you can see i just increase the metallic value so it become a metal okay so how you can make this so i'm just going to show you from the scratch so now i'm just going to add a new file okay and first of all i'm just going to the front view and i will add one plane here like this and i will change the uh, align as a view so now we can see the plane in a front and after that i will add one cylinder also and i am just going to uh, decrease the radius little bit like that okay and i am just going to increase the depth i think that is enough and i we should decrease the depth little bit so that is fine okay then after that i am just going to uh, keep that rod here like this okay and uh, i'm just going to select the plane and going to uh, stretch like this okay and i'm just going to select the both uh, vertices and uh, and i'm just going to putting inside little bit okay so here you can see now we have a flag here okay and if you want to decrease the size of that rod you can decrease little bit i think that is fine yeah okay so now here you can see we have a flag here okay then after that what i will do i'm just going to the front view and i'm just going to select the plane and apply the scale control a okay like this and after that i'm just going to edit mode again and going to select the plane pressing the a and do right click and do subdivide in 30 cut like this so now we have a uh, lots of uh, mesh in our plane okay then after that i'm just going to hide that uh, cylinder for a while now i'm going to select the my plane again i'm going to select those vertices and now i'm going to the uh, vertex group panel and i'm just assign these vertices as a vertex group so now we have uh, these vertex group okay then i'm just going to unhide that um, cylinder and uh, i'm just going to apply as a scale also okay and uh, i'm just going to add a little detailing here okay so for that i'm just going to select the top face and do extrude like this and uh, scale little bit I'm just going to bevel like that and that is enough okay and after that you can do smooth as well okay so now uh, we have a uh, lots of mesh in our plane so now we need to uh, animate this so for that what I will do I'm just going to add a one uh, force field as a wind so here you can see we have a wind here and I'm just going to rotate it according to our flag like that okay and here you can see it should be in front of that uh, flag okay and after that i'm just going to the uh, wind properties and uh, here you can see we have a strength so i'm just going to take a strength uh, for starting 500 and uh, adding the noise amount 10 okay and before playing the animation we need to add a cloth physics uh, also add in the plane so for that i'm just going to select the plane and adding the cloth so here you can see we have uh, some preset here so for example i'm just going to add the denim okay and after that uh, i'm just going to add the shape menu these vertex which is we have selected that time okay and make sure you enable that uh, self collision okay and uh, after that you can select the cylinder and add the collusion as well 
so I think all set now and we can rotate it a little bit like that yeah that is enough so when I play the animation so here you can see that flag is perfectly um, so now we need to uh, increase the strength okay it's not flying uh, properly so for that what I will do I'm just going to increase the strength uh, 2500 like this I think now it will fly nicely yeah so here you can see guys it's flying very nicely and I think we need a uh, um, we need to move this little bit like that and now here you can see it's uh, flying very perfectly okay so now I'm just going to add the texture on it so how we can add the texture so for that I'm just going to the to switch my viewport shading okay and after that I'm just uh, adding the material so I'm just going to add a base color as a image texture and I'm just going to locate my uh, flag so here I have that flag okay so here you can see it's perfectly apply uh, if, if it is not apply perfectly so what you can do you just uh, go to the edit mode and select the all faces and do U and uh, and press the U and uh, you will find that option projection from the view uh, you can just click on it so here you can see you will perfectly uh, project that uh, texture on the plane okay then after that I'm just going to add the uh, material on that rod also so for that I'm just going to uh, add new material and uh, I'm just increasing the metallic value like that and decreasing the roughness so here you can see we have a rod also here so now I'm just going to play the animation so here you can see it's perfectly uh, flying but uh, that flag is not looking good okay so for that you can uh, do the shade smooth and if you find still these edges so you can apply this subdivision uh, surface so now we have a perfect plane here here you can see yeah so now it's perfectly uh, flying here you can see so that's how you can make the uh, flag in the blender okay so thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button hit the share button and subscribe my channel also and if you have any queries if you have any suggestion please let me know in the comment box i will definitely reply your comment so bye bye take care stay home